Hello everybody! Today is the start of our moving series, I guess is what we're gonna call it, but we're apartment hunting. I think we're looking at three places today, so let's go. We're in apartment number one, and so far it's nice. It gets a lot of natural lighting. I think the one issue is that this closet is smaller than our current one, and that's like one of our issues right now. But I really like the natural lighting and the openness. God, the lighting is crazy. It like puts me in such a better mood. Apartment number two, this one's the one with the little den. It's like a cute, cozy space. I can't make a whole setup room in here. All right, we're on to apartment number two. And then after this one, I think we have a bit of time before our next, right? Mm -hmm. We're gonna get food and then we'll sit down and talk about our thoughts. We are in the third apartment and so far it's looking real nice. We're on a really high floor this time, so the view is freaking crazy and then the closet so much bigger so much more spacious and then i didn't show it but every single unit so far has had a balcony this one is very spacious though i'm so excited i feel like i could see kiloa just chilling out here wow look this shit's crazy and then this right here is the master so probably put my setup here room number four this one is sort of similar layout, but it's facing a different way so we would get sunrise. It also has a darker finish and no island, but I think we really want the island. I don't know, man. Can't stop thinking about that one we just saw. Hello, little guy. Can you do it? What did you think of the first apartment? Oh, the first one I really liked because the layout was a lot more simpler compared Functional. to- Functional. Yes. Compared to the second one, it was very open. And then I also really liked the light. Despite being on a lower floor, I felt like it was lit very well. Yeah. The only issue, the closet was smaller than our current closet. Yeah, so that's the only which thing is crazy. With that. The closets were pretty small. We technically had three closets though. We had True. the one in the bedroom, um, the oh. one in my stream room, which would be my storage. And then we had another coat closet, which was like, and we don't have a coat closet here. So overall, I really liked it. I just wish it was on a higher floor okay for me. I didn't and, fall in love with it. Um, and what do you think of the second building? I love the second building. Or I second mean, building, second apartment. Oh, Sorry. second apartment I did <laughs> not like. It was really dark. I expected the den to be a little bigger. I really want to incorporate a stream room again. I'll make do with what I have. But with the den, it definitely wasn't big enough. Like, I think my desk would be the only thing that fit in there. And I'm not complaining. What we're thinking is if we did end up with that option, we might turn it into a walk-in closet. Mm -hmm. And overall, I felt like the second unit in the first building was kind of just awkward uh, in terms of the layout. Yeah, it was a two bedroom. It was slightly bigger. There was a lot of weird corners. And I think one thing also was that it was looking directly next to like a parking garage, mm -hmm. which is like if we want to be on our balcony, it's kind of like we want it to be private, you know what I mean? So second building was my favorite. The first unit at the second building was by far both of our favorites, right? For sure. One of the bathrooms had a bathtub and one of them had a freaking walk-in shower. Yep. Like it's not the end of the world if I don't get that, but just having that option is so it's just so cool to me. And then the closets were twice as big. I think the closets in the bathrooms were 10 out of 10. Right? Yes. I think the kitchen was maybe 8 out of 10. Yeah, kitchen layout was, was better okay. in the other apartment. In the apartment. first, first uh, apartment that we The first viewed. unit we viewed. First unit. Oh, another thing I liked about the second building was that the bedrooms, the primary bedrooms, had two walls that were glass. Or were glass, oh, windows? Or windows. I definitely preferred that. I think it gives it a unique look and just is, isn't is something that the, we even saw in the other building, so. The balconies in the second apartment building were also a lot wider. They were, yeah, more deep. The second unit, what'd you think? I preferred the lighter finishes than the darker finishes. And also it didn't have a island. And then there's like this little desk space that I feel like we wouldn't really utilize. Mm -hmm. Maybe if it had lighter finishes, I also don't really like the little desk. It also had the corner glass thing where like for the bedroom. Oh, the view in this one was, was crazy though. Like at least the city view, not necessarily oh, the sunlight nice. because we got basically the entire city. But the sunlight, Wouldn't. like the actual sunshine would cut out by noon. Was out, yeah, by noon. One. And that's when we wake up. So. <laughs> 
I don't know. Starting out strong with that first one was crazy. First one was like checked off a lot of boxes. Apartment number three was... Yeah. That was a good one. So definitely the ones I preferred were the first two units at each building. Mm -hmm. I could see us living in both. But we still have one more place to tour today. We gotta eat. Are you excited? Oh, I'm hungry. We got Hawaiian food. We're gonna eat really quickly and watch All American. But after this, we're gonna go to apartment building number three. As we were leaving, we saw a envelope taped to our door and it was about re-signing our lease. And I just think the timing is crazy. They're watching us, they got us micro. <laughs> there weren't really any rooms available to look at, but we did go into one of them and it was so freaking nice. She didn't let us film though, cause it was an incomplete room, but it was so nice. It felt very luxurious. I loved the finishes but it was the priciest one we've looked at so far. But it was real freaking nice, right honey? For sure. <laughs> Hello everyone, today is day two of apartment hunting. And once again, we're running late, so let's go. Okay. We're in apartment building one for the day, but I think out of all of them, number four, Four. This is the first unit in the master bedroom. The view is still so freaking nice. We have two closets, so I guess this would be some sort of coat closet. Well, my closet. So you I get, get the big, big one? <laughs> and then there's this big closet. And then the master bathroom, which has a separated shower and bathtub. And the bathtub is like hella low. And I really like that the toilet is separated. It feels like a hotel. I really like this one. All right, unit number two. I'm in the master bedroom. Again, super big closet. And basically the same exact layout for everything except there's no extra closet in the bathroom. This one's a lot bigger than the last layout. The yeah. kitchen, living room. Next building, another great freaking view. This one, you can see the whole city really well. I like that the master is very straightforward. It's just a square, so you don't gotta worry about any weird pillars. Walk-in closet. I wish there's little compartments though. And then the bathrooms have automatic lights, which is cool. Are they? Yeah, I just walked in, they turned on. And I think Lo really likes this place because he loves concrete. The kitchen's super cute, but I think we'd have to get some sort of island. All right, next unit, crazy view. And this one has a balcony. I don't think the other one did. And then we got the master. It has this little shelving area. I like this one a lot. It feels more spacious. So I can definitely put my setup in here and still decorate it. Real freaking cute. Third and last one for this building. But I think this one's the same exact layout as the last one we looked, but the ceilings are so freaking high, so it makes this place look huge. See, look at this. We're back at the first building we ever toured, but it's a self tour this time. So we got all the vlogging. Oh, my ears popped. I that's told Lo, that's we, how I know we're going know, high up. That's how you know you made it. <laughs> when your ears pop in the elevator. We walked in and Lo literally said it feels like we're in the freaking clouds. And then we got the beautiful wooden fridge. And I love that there's so much pantry space. The sinks are also freaking tiny and the storage in the bathrooms are also kind of small. And I have quite a bit of skincare. Let's check out the other bathroom. I think this one's a little bigger. Again, tiny freaking sink. Let me go out on the balcony and show you guys this crazy view. It's a little foggy right now. Oh my god, imagine if it was bright, sunny, and clear. I really like this one. The only issue is the closet space. But the light... Imagine us living here. Imagine this place furnished. All right, since we have this place to ourselves, I wanted to talk about the apartments that we just viewed. We still have one more today. 
Lowe's joining us now. So in the last, no, the first one that we viewed, I almost said the name, but in the first one that we viewed, it was nice. Like it was pretty luxurious. And the amenities felt like you were at a resort. It felt corporate though. Very, very corporate. It felt like you were in like an office building and the space and layout was really nice, but the kitchen barely had any storage in it. Not ideal, but it was the really nice. The view was good, but it wasn't great. The second one, you were literally staring at the a building. The second one was not a good view. The bedroom was just really awkward with that pillar. And then the second building that we looked at was really nice. It was a little more old school looking compared to the ones we've been looking at. I mean, old school in rel is relative because it was probably built in like 2014. This mm -hmm. the other ones, this, this one's built 2019. So like it's these like ones 2020. So are bougie. Like but yeah, they were nice. The parking situation was a little awkward. And the first layout we looked at, when it was literally a zigzag. Yeah, I didn't like that. At the entrance, that was so weird. The third one had the best of both worlds. It had the city view and it had Lois the sun. So, and it so, had the high so ceilings. So in love with the high ceilings. It That's just like, didn't have the greatest kitchen, you know? But well, the kitchen, we would prefer an island. I don't know. I'm really in love with this one. The wooden aesthetic, the view. It's just kind of small. It's the smallest that we viewed today. And I know you guys are probably watching going like, oh my God, that is not small. It's just, we have a lot of stuff. It's not like random stuff, it's content stuff. Especially him. That's why he needs his own office because he has like his film sets his little mini film sets and it'd just be nice for him to not have to take it down because he was in the living room before. And then the bedroom here, I think if not smaller, it might be the same size as our current one. And he's worried that my setup won't fit in there. And something that's important for me is to have my streaming space, like the one in Vegas, because I really miss that in the current spot that we're at. I almost said the name. <laughs> So that's something I wanted to implement here. But I don't know. I can imagine us living here. Overall though, we can't complain. We're very blessed to be able to even look at these high rise places. I remember when I was younger, I always wanted a view like this. I can imagine, I'm gonna start crying. I don't know why I'm getting emotional right now. <laughs> I'm gonna start crying. I was about to say that I could imagine my mom coming over and just looking outside and just living her best life. I'm gonna cry. All right, cut the camera. We decided to cancel on the last one. We just lost interest in it over time, but it's okay. I feel like we looked at a lot of really freaking good options. Like I said earlier, I cannot believe that we're fortunate enough to be able to live in super nice places like this, but I think this is gonna be it for this apartment hunting video. Let me know which one was your favorite. Maybe we'll choose that one. But as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.